It's up to you to put the punch in these next barns. Now, the brake rods of these trucks are supposed to have been tampered with by the villains. The other drivers will jump from their trucks. But you, knowing the value of the cargo you are carrying, will try to ride it through in spite of everything. Understand clearly what you have to do? Yes, sir. I'll stick with that truck no matter what happens. Till you stop the scene. Hello, boy. Ready, Tom? Ready. Signal the trucks to start. Camera! Barnes is a wow. Barnes, don't stop your crashes. Something's going wrong, you can't stop. Thought you were a goner that time, Burnham. Up. Look at that truck. Barnes, you've given us the biggest thrill of the picture, and we didn't expect it. Neither did I. But when the brakes wouldn't work, I. What do you mean the brakes wouldn't work? I tested them myself just before we shot the seed. So did I. But somebody must have tampered with them while Mr. Lambert was giving us our instructions. Well, I saw a fellow caught up from under that truck, but I thought he was one of our men. Well, where is he? We'll get him. He's probably gone by now, Eddie, but I know who he's working for. Mr. Lambert, can I take one of your cars? I've got to get you a phone right away. Certainly, Barnes. Eddie will fix you up. Ring again, Central, will you? Shut up. Hello, this is Amir Tone. Mr. Burnham Upper Barnes? He's an O'Hare. He's our mech of the stunt for the mood of pitch. No, Tony. This is Barnes talking. Oh, excuse me, please. Sure, sure. I call him Mr. Marty right away. Tony, what is it? Oh, it's uh, for you. I was just going to call you. Hello? Yes, Burnham Up. What? They made another attempt to kill you. Yes, and I'm convinced that Warren was behind it. He knows that as long as I have this job at the picture company, you won't have to sell your land. I don't care anything about my land. Are you all right? Of course I am. But Warren might try to make you believe I was killed. Force you to sell. <laughs> don't you worry about me. I'll keep my eyes open. I must hurry back to work now. Goodbye. Goodbye. 
So Warren's men tried to get Burnham up again. That Warren, he's a no good. Some of day he's gonna kill a Burnham up. I'm going to put a stop to this right now. What are you gonna do? Warren Automobile Company? I'd like to speak to Mr. Warren, please. Oh, hello, Miss Temple. This is a pleasant surprise. What can I do for you? Why, of course, my offer is still good. If you're willing to sell, I'll come right over and close the deal. Well, that won't be necessary. I'll send Bobby over with the deed, and you can give him a check. All right. Goodbye. But, uh, Mrs. Marge, what do you think if Burnham Ups are going to say about this? Boy, he'll be mad. Well, that land's worth a lot of money. Don't you see this is the only way to stop these attacks on Burnham Up? He's been a real partner and a true friend. And I'm not going to let him be murdered just to save my property. Take this to Mr. Warren's office. He'll give you a check to bring back. Grande Dio. Hello? This is Tony, me. Hello? Jingle up your hook. Then I told you to shut up. your check. Now maybe you'll let Burnham up alone. What are you talking about? You know what I mean. Hey, that fellow Barn certainly is a tough customer. I wrecked his truck, Be but... Careful. Barnes' garage just left here. I was afraid he might have heard you. Oh. So he didn't get Barnes, eh? No, but... Well, never mind. It doesn't make any difference now. I've got what I wanted. Take a look at this. What the need to Miss Temple's land? Millions of dollars worth of oil land for a song. When do we start drilling? Just as soon as you can get the equipment on the job. I'll get busy right now. Won't Miss Temple be surprised when we bring in a gusher on that land? Oh, just a minute, Parsons. Well, Mr. Warren, hadn't I better wait until you get the deed recorded? No, go right ahead. I'll take the deed down and have it recorded right now. The valuable deed has been stolen from my desk. Whoever stole it must have slipped in through the hall door. That's impossible. I locked the door. That's it. He got away down the fire escape. No, he hasn't had time. He's probably ducked into one of the windows on the lower floor. Where's Stevens and his men? Just down the hall. Surround the building. Don't let anybody leave. Keep your eye open for that kid. He has the deed. He drives the tow car from Barnes' garage. Let's see if it's still parked outside.
The tow car is there, all right. That means he's still in the building. Jimmy Hempstead, 3125. Hello. This is Bobby. I'm a prisoner in Mr. Warren's office. Maybe you're exciting yourself for nothing, Mr. Warren. Let's look again. Perhaps you just misplaced the deed. I tell you, it's been stolen. I've got to get Parsons and stop him until I get the deed back. Let me get him on the phone. How did this phone get knocked off my desk? Why, I don't know, sir. Hello? Bobby? Bobby? Hello, Bobby? Hello? Well, don't... Stop that kid! He's going up to the roof. Get upstairs and hit him off. Tony! Tony! Quick, burn him up. Bobby's in trouble. Where is he? At Mr. Warren's office. They've got him locked up. What's he doing there? I sent him there with a deed to my property. Give me that deed, kid. Why are you? Watch where that paper lands and then bring it up to Warren's office. Open door. Did you get that deed? The kid threw it off the roof. Fraser's gone after him. You little scoundrel. Take him down to Warren's office. It's not here. 
It must have fallen out. No, young man, will you kindly tell me why you stole that deed from my desk? Because you're trying to cheat Miss Temple. I heard what you said about that oil. to the deed. I hit it up on the roof. Good, let's get it. Somebody open the door. Open this door. We found the envelope, but the deed was gone. It's still up on the roof. Barnes and the kid are after it now. One of you go up the fire escape. We'll trap them. I hit it on that corner. Good work, Bobby. Stop where you are, Barnes. Stop that deep, Barnes, or I'll shoot. Come on, brother. 